During primary school and secondary school, I've always been kind of an all-rounder, so good across all my subjects. But I've kind of realised that, you know, maths and sciences were the way forward for me. I also found that the more the sciences subjects, the class size got smaller and also the diversity in the class got smaller as well. So I was usually one of very few females and the only black girl in my further maths class. It never kind of put me off, it made me a bit more competitive. My economics teacher actually inspired me to go on and do engineering. As a career choice, it was good for me. Everyone kind of told me I was heavily male. I didn't really see what the problem was because as an engineer, you kind of look beyond the initial appearance anyway to get the job solved. I came from Africa when I was quite young and my mother herself, she had quite a drastic career change. However, she always told me that if opportunity doesn't knock, you have to go out and create it for yourself. I didn't really have many positive role models, especially in the career path that I wanted to. Finding a female role model was an issue, so finding a black female was an even bigger one. What I am currently doing right now is kind of providing that figurehead for younger girls. So anything that I can do to help them go in that path that they want to, I'm always happy to help. The African Caribbean Professional Network just reminds me that I can actually feel at home. Being in a company that kind of celebrates where I'm from, I won't have to think twice about going to work, about hiding, you know, what I eat, how I do my hair, etc. A key mission of the African Caribbean Professional Network is to ultimately improve project outcomes through the understanding of language and culture of its employees within Rolls-Royce. So they do this by hosting events that celebrate and promote, you know, all of our different cultures and where we come from. And you also find that you usually have more in common with your colleague who grew up 3,000 miles on the other side of the earth than you would actually assume. So it is good to find that common ground in the workplace.